All right, so I was in a Skeppy event the other day and the prize was $25,000 if you win first place. And me going into it, you know, I'd already been in a few Skeppy events, so it's not like I was expecting to win or anything, but I might as well take a shot, you know? And I actually entered it with a bunch of my friends Oh, okay. So we had a pretty good shot of at least getting one of us to win out of 100 people, right? We had like maybe 15 people out of 100 all teamed up. So if one of us won, we could like split it part way. So, you know, if you've ever watched the Skeppy video, they, uh, he does a bunch of little events, eventually killing off people until they get to the last person alive. And I actually made it pretty far in this last one. There was things like parkour runs, PvP duels, etc. All that kind of stuff. But I got to one round where I kind of messed up. <laughs> If you ever try to throw an ender pearl straight up into the air, it's kind of hard to uh, predict where it's going to land sometimes. If I throw it straight up there, I have no idea where it's going to be. Usually just a couple blocks away. However, if you angle it like a few blocks or a few degrees that way, it's going to land like 30 blocks over there, right? So my point is it's really hard to accurately aim an ender pearl when you're shooting it straight up. And <laughs> the round that I was in, you have to throw an ender pearl up and land on a platform by predicting it. Me not practicing for this, I, I'm pretty sure I was screwed. I was out. So, you know, I throw my ender pearl, whatever. A bunch of other people do it. A bunch of people make it. A bunch of people don't make it. And I actually didn't make it the first time I did it. I lost my ender pearl. We only had one, so we had one shot. But since a bunch of people failed and there's a bunch of us left, Skeppy decided to drop us extra ender pearls to give us multiple tries, right? And I actually got lucky enough. I was one of the few people who got a second chance. I picked up another ender pearl. So you'd think with a second chance, there's no way I can mess it up now, right? I literally have had the best chance of making it past this round. But I actually, uh, <laughs> I tried to go with a different approach this time. I tried throwing it straight ahead and purling onto somebody's hitbox so that I would hit them instead of going past the edge of the platform. But, uh, didn't exactly what was planned. And I actually ended up hitting Bubbles' hitbox on the edge of the platform. I was telling Bro to try to scoot back. And we were in the same call while this happened. I was telling him to scoot back so that I could, like, you know, have him catch my pearl. But we kind of messed it up. And, uh, yeah, my second pearl flew off the thing. And that is how I lost. I was eliminated and I lost $25,000. So I guess the moral of the story is uh, practice ender pearl predictions if you want to win Skeppy event or money. <laughs> um, I'm doing daily uploads of these videos, so make sure to subscribe and comment what videos you want to see next. That is it. Goodbye. Let me in! Let me in! Oh my god! No way! Oh! <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs>